Hello guys, you're welcome to the channel. My name is Yawasin Pizachere and as always, this is Ashko TV, the official YouTube channel for Aceda House Commodities. This is a very rare moment and a very rare um, video and this is information that I that has occurred to me. I'm traveling on my bike from Tachimai, from Kranzan to Tachimai and I feel like somebody needs to hear this because we are in the in the period that planting is going on. You know, maize farming, the planting is going on. And this is an information that you need to hear. Please stop cutting corners. Stop cutting corners. Okay. Stop patronizing cheap farming inputs. Okay. See your farm as a business. Look at your farm as a business. Because the way you treat it is the way it will treat you. The way your farm you treat your farm is the way it, it, it will treat you. Now, come to think of it, there is something that I have said in a previous video, and I want to reiterate it. If you take maize farming, for example, uh, if you look behind me, people are plowing. This is just by the roadside. Though. People are plowing and farming. Okay, they are farming. They are doing a lot of farming activities at you know this stretch. I'm so happy when I see, you know, farming activities like this. All right. I'm so happy when I see farming activities like this. Now, back to what I was talking about. Back to what, what I was talking about. There are elements or items in your budget, in your farming, in your maize farm budget that are constant. Item number one is labor. Labor is constant. Whatever you do. You look, you hire labor. Whatever you do, you hire labor. The second one is your weed control. Whatever you do, you do what? You have to control your weed. You have to control your weed. All right. The third one is fertilizer. Whatever you do, whatever maize type of maize farming you feel like you're doing, you will have to do what? We call fertilizer application. Okay. Now, for, for these three items that I just mentioned, people put a lot of emphasis on it. They, they don't joke with it. But when it comes to seed selection or the, the type of seed they should grow, you know, they want to cut corners. They want to buy inferior seed. Meanwhile, it is this seed that is going to give you the yield that you are expecting. The expected yield that you have. It is this seed. That is going to give you the yield. So why do you cut corners on getting your your seed your your seeds? Okay, a lot of farmers in Ghana go oh, most of the time go for the open market seed. I have done it before, and I and the farm was a, a strong failure. It didn't work one bit. Okay, now. My point for standing in this sun and making this video is that if you have not yet bought your, your May seeds yet, please, please, buy quality seeds. Buy quality seeds. Okay? So that you can get your yield. All right? It's, 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 it's high time we, you know, put a stop to this... Um, I have I've done maize farm. I've done a maize farm. I've gone into maize farming. I didn't get the, I didn't get the yield. I didn't get the yield. You all these complaints will be coming, and we forget that there are a lot of things, a lot of important things that we didn't, you know, put in emphasis, put in much emphasis. The way you treat your maize farm, the way you treat your business, just like any other business, the way you treat it is the way it will treat you. Okay, don't do it. You know. Don't give it half attention. Don't give your business half attention. Give it your full attention, your 100%. And I believe so well that you will get your yield and you will get, you will get that uh, profit that you anticipate. This is the information that I'm trying, that I want to give you today. Please don't cut corners when it comes to your seed. Look for, make, do your own research. I'm not the one to, you know, um, 
decide which seed you should use. Of course, if uh, when, it, when it gets to the point that a lot of you use some particular seed, particular type of, you know, hybrid seed, and you recommend it, we will share it on this channel. But for now, please do your research, get your seed, get your seed, quality hybrid seed, so that you can get your yield, okay? And say the good stories of agribusiness. All right. So I'm going to end this video here and continue with my journey. There are cars passing by, just parked by the by the roadside to you know to get this information across. Once again, my name is Yao Simpsetra. This is Ashko TV. Until we meet in the next one, it's bye bye for now.